What's up everybody? Welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority. And for today we're going to put to the test Jet Boil Genesis Base Camp system. So I have put to the test plenty of the camping racket store for mini stoves that is actually for the backpack and long hiking. This one is not really for hiking but if you're camping out out of the truck or out of the camper this is might be really really useful or maybe even by the beach or by the lake. So let's open it up and see what it's all about. First of all look at this beautiful packaging. And I love the jet boil camping stove, the tiny one. So I'm really having high expectation for this one as well. You open it up like this and boom. Wow, look, it comes in a pot. Can you believe this? I guess this is plastic piece that is protects your pot. So when you wanna transport it, I'm gonna keep it in there actually. And what is that? Fill regulator. Awesome. Right away I'm gonna get the fill regulator and get rid of the box. Nice. That looks beautiful. I don't need the box. I can just keep this thing in a bag for the next time. Okay, let's see what's inside of this jet boil pack. Or what? I mean, there you go. There's a bunch of instructions. Oh wow, look at that. Wow, so sleek. Look at that design and this paper. There's a bunch of warning stuff. We're just gonna unclip it or just leave it be. So how does this open? Boom, like that. And something else is holding it. Like this. Wow, check this out. This is like an oven at home. It's so big, but it's so compact when you put it together. That's so beautiful. Look how tiny that is. And then once you unfold it, it's like doubles in size. Insane. Okay, let me put the fill regulator in first. Check it out, right here, that's how you start it, I guess. The fill regulator is going to go in here. Pop it in and screw it on. And then we'll need one of these propane tanks. It holds a lot of gas. Right here, this is how you adjust the gas and start it. Let me take this paper out before we start the fire. And I see the spark. Alright, this one is on. Check this out. I guess you really have to turn it on. There you go, this one is on now. Let's see how long it will take to boil water this whole pot. Oh wow, look, it actually comes with a pan as well. So we're gonna cook eggs on one side and boil water on the other side. I'm actually going to time it, see how long will it take for me to boil this whole pot of water. I love this cover by the way, so that way we're not wasting the other cover. That way it can be like a pan. So, just turn this one on and click it on. I'm gonna cook some egg on this one. Get some oil, grab this pan on top there, heat it up a little bit and then we're gonna grab a couple eggs. Oh no, it's about to rain. I better finish up this video. Let's see if this camping stove will work in the rain anyways. We all been camping, sometimes it's raining all day, so we're gonna cook anyways. I love my eggs sunny side up, or you can do scramble, whatever you like. But yeah, looking, looking good so far. We gotta camp in any weather, we don't care. You know what, to get it faster, we're just gonna flip it. This is turned out to be scramble eggs. Obviously we're going to add some salt and we're going to eat that in the rain. Because you never know what's gonna happen during the camping time. And by the rain all day, we still gotta eat. But I love it, even during the rain, 
it still works because these pots covering up the gas so I don't have to worry about the gas turning off this is actually an amazing test so is this one look at that who cares that it's raining on top of it but it's protecting the gas from turning off from the rain and also I really like this pot because it has this heating system so it absorbs all of the heat and that way the water is going to boil really really fast look at that it's about to start boiling and we haven't even finished eggs look how much water there is no way by the way guys I'm not afraid of rain Luke is not either I love it I'd rather be in the rain than being all day really really hot finally it's raining if anything this is why it's so amazing to have gas camping stove because it's a lot faster to cook food it's a lot faster to boil water and when it's raining this much your bonfire might go off or your fire would get all wet I mean I would not have a problem starting a fire and getting a big fire going during the rain but I know a lot of people will struggle or you don't even have any firewood you don't need it because you can cook with this thing even during the rain okay guys pouring down the rain I don't know the fire might go out a little bit of salt no big deal we're not staying hungry tonight at the camp yeah look at this perfect eggs running mmm this is delicious I can camp like this all day don't have to worry about firewood or fire going off on me anyway all those people who is cooking on a fire especially you want to cook on a not on the flames but on the coals those coals with the rain like that probably will go off my camping stove has plenty of gas and plenty of cover so that way it doesn't even matter if it's raining you not be hungry at your camp I love it I think Luke wants some egg as well let's check on our water it's almost boiling and all I did cook eggs and ate them so the so much water it's insane how fast it's boiling honestly check this out 10 minutes look how heavily it's boiling probably not even 10 minutes this stuff is so powerful I can't believe it this propane tanks last a while as well they're pretty big wow and what do you need so much boiled water for for well, Luke obviously because he's hungry as well if he's in the camp look I got three dogs to feed but yeah if you have more than two people you'll need a lot of water for all these bags let's say you have like five to eight people you need lots of water to fill up each one a pack of them so you can boil water really fast for everybody put it in this thing or you can even cook inside this whole thing and make soup whatever definitely a huge thumbs up for me I can't believe how fast it boiled the water and all it is you just untwist it right here and it's gonna shut off the gas I think the reason why it's boiling so fast because of this pot system you see all that stuff inside there I feel like it just holds all the heat inside of the pot okay next let's see how hard it is to put everything away oh it's still hot so all you do is let's see if it's hot wow this is not even too hot I can actually touch it and it's been on max for a while for like 10 minutes there's right here a handle I should be using that boom wow look at that design it's a little bit warm but not too hot as you can see I can still touch it then you can take off this gas thing try to do it as fast as possible there you go and then I can take off the gas regulator That scared me right there but that's how it works when you take it out be quick about it okay let's try to put it away see what it looks like boom cowl goes back on top like this jet boil another lid goes on top like this folds we gotta drop it inside there boom heat regulator gonna go inside here easy cover it up 
Wow! That's pretty much it. Let me know comments below. What do you think about this thing? Don't forget to thumbs up this video, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.